Andrew Sellers is dissecting a lionfish that he's caught in the tropical shallows on the Caribbean side of the Panama Isthmus. The lionfish is that striking, banded, tropical species with long, venomous spines so popular in home aquaria. But it isn't a native species in the Caribbean. It's an invasive species, introduced either intentionally or by accident into the waters off Florida sometime 15 or 20 years ago. So basically the lionfish uh, is one of the more popular fish in the aquarium trade, um, especially in Florida where a lot of the uh, imports for aquarium trade happen. Uh, they were introduced from Indonesia, from the, from the uh, Indo-Pacific uh, region into Florida as an as a aquarium fish. In 2005 they started noticing them in the Bahamas uh, and they've been slowly moving through the Caribbean until recently where they recently got to Panama in 2009. Part of the sampling for Andrew's project is being done at the Smithsonian Tropical Research Institute's research station on Colon Island in the Bocas del Toro archipelago. Andrew is examining the diet of the lionfish, their general abundance, and the parasites that they host in order to monitor this invasion. His hypothesis? In tropical areas, the potential for accumulating parasites might be greater because species diversity for all organisms, including parasites, is greater in this zone. He counts the parasites that he finds, particularly in the gills of the lionfish, to evaluate the impacts of this invader and also to evaluate the extent to which it moves parasites around or accumulates them. That may reveal any role this species plays in the transmission of parasites and in the transmission of disease-causing agents. What could be the impact? Could have. I mean, uh, since they're consuming fish and uh, invertebrates, you could have a uh, you know, decrease in the populations of specific species. You could have decreases in populations of uh, ecologically and economically important species such as groupers because they could be eating their, their juveniles or competing with, with juveniles of the relatively same size to the lionfish for, mm -hmm. other, for, for other prey. Um, on the microscope. As far as management goes, um, maybe the impacts, uh, you know, like what kind of fish they're eating if we find that they're eating species that other predators consume and that the lionfish are competing with, we could uh, um, use this information to improve on management strategies, but as far as controlling the invasion, that is a very difficult subject.